Scrapbook.com is here at the Creativation 2017 show. We're in the Sizzix booth, and I'm here with Eileen Hall, and this is her heartfelt collection, and mm -hmm. she's going to show you what's new about this line and the other elements. All right, I will take it away. Here is the kind of the base of the whole collection. Uh, this is a journal, it's called Journal. It's for all those who like to do the junk journals, the travel journals, the Midoris, the planners, this is the book for you. It's a scoreboard die, and all the other dies in the collection, there are five others, will complement this piece. So they will all work in it. We have, uh, this one is cut out of paper leather, but it will work with the mat board. So you can cover that with fabric, felt, you can use your ink, stain sprays, stamps, all that stuff. So it's, it's like a blank canvas to make it whatever you want. Inside, there uh, is where you put your inserts. Oh. So you can have, like, say you want to make one for Christmas, and you do your cover in a Christmas theme, cover it with paper, and then you make your calendar, your photos, your gift list, and then you can take them in and out as you travel or uh, want to swap it out next year. Just take the ones for this year out and put new ones in. Can you so. show us what this die looks like yes. in the store? Yes, it's an XL die. This one has a little bit of paper on it because somebody went crazy, but this is what it looks like. So it's big. It's eight and three quarters by about four and a half. So it will hold three to four inserts inside. And this here is a label piece so you can make your title. Um, this is a latch if you don't want to use elastic. And this here is a tab. So you get all those pieces on one. I've even die cut this out of felt, put a zipper. I cut two pieces, put a zipper so you can make a pouch. I try to design dies that have a lot of uses. So this is, you know, one of your bigger dies. So you want to use it as, as much as you can. Uh, this is one of the other um, collect this is a thinless set that uh, what we did was we traced this and kind of doodled and sprayed and stamped um, these shapes here on the cover so that's one and then we have um, these are words that you can stitch or you can um, use on the front of a card sorry so she just outlined it but you could also put your threads in there and stitch that um, here's my new paper pad, and all of these images and colors are coordinated um, with, with the dies. Uh, this here is a, also a scoreboards die, and that is a little basket. And you can use that for a picnic basket, an Easter, Easter basket, a favor. Uh, is it so. called scoreboards die because it cuts and, and scores. Okay. Right. It's a scoring blade. It's not a crease blade. So when you're working with the thick materials, you need to, um, it, it only goes one way. You know, if you fold it the wrong way, it'll snap. But if you do it the other way, you have a nice sturdy project and, you know, a nice substantial structural piece. So uh, here's another one. These are nice for the little a bird and butterfly. Uh, this is a little, it's called the house pocket because if you hold it, yes, here we go, thank you. <laughs> if you um, add all the little embellishments, it's a house, but if you turn it upside down, it's a pocket shape. So you can do all kinds of things with this. This is great for kids to learn how to sew because these are large holes and you can use yarn or whatever and you just cut two of them, match the holes up, stitch through. So uh, even those little fingers can do that. And honestly, for me, my eyes are not so good. So that's a nice target. <laughs> it's uh, good for me too. So. Um, I think it's a pretty versatile collection. Here are some of the older ones that are coming back, but I've done them in felt. So this is like a little shopping bag. It is a scoreboards die, but you can also cut it out of felt. And we have it right over there. So um, right way over there. Yeah. Yeah, that's it. Those are adorable. Well, thank you. Thank you. So we have also our little trailer, which you can make out of felt as a pin cushion, but it also works uh, you know, 3D out of map board. So what I'm all about is trying to give value to people who buy these because who wants to buy a die and one time you use it and then you don't have any other reason to, you know, play with it. So the more the better, right? I love it. Okay, thank you thank very you much so for much showing for us by. your new line. Thanks. Great seeing you guys.